crude oil real quick. All right, with news events, what we want to do is we want to wait until news is posted. This is crude oil inventories, crude oil inventories. You want to wait 15 to 20 seconds after the news report. Once that's posted, you can get long or short off these value areas. The best way to trade news events is you trade off these solid red and green outer edge areas. Now, what you want to do is you want to see what the trend is going into the news. We know the Magenta MA, right there, Magenta MA, that is our trend filter. We don't use moving averages for support and resistance. They're worthless for support and resistance and crossovers, but they're great for trend direction. The trend finally established itself to be down. We're parallel. Moving averages are parallel. Looks like car tracks. So going into the news event here at 1030, we know to sell retracements or sell HVA high value area. The news pops. We get a nice little sell, a nice little pop in the market into my high value. Now, if you look, this is a stack level. The solid line is my volume profile that looks at all the volume, all the algorithms, hedge funds, prop firms amateur professional traders and gives us a nice resistance level right there just over 70 okay and then my price profile at the time was right there at 68 so this morning i talked about 6870 as the level of a major play and that was the major inflection point on the news event it popped it to 6870 consequently i have another profile over here which is my Developing profile that was sitting at 68 also. So if you look at the news, it actually touched right on it to the exact tick. The exact tick high was 68 on my developing profile. Now what we call this is we call this three times stacked area. We call this a brick wall. If I got my three profiles, my number one profile is my solid red and my solid green and blue. My solid red is volume. My little dots on the black chart is price profile. It's been around since 1985. Volume's been around since 1994. So it gave me two times stacked area there. Consequently, my developing profile sitting at a trend retracement at 68, 69 at the time, actually 70 at the time, it called the high to the exact tick. So that gave me three times market profile. I have my volume, which is my solid line, my price profile, which are the dot lines, price profile, HVA, volume solid line high value area and my developing profile high value area that is what's called a stack level or confluence that's called a confluence level or stack level we call it a brick wall if three of these profiles come within two ticks of each other on any market whether you trade the s p 500 the euro the dollar it doesn't matter what you trade crude oil gold it doesn't matter silver any stock any currency it doesn't matter if they come within two or three ticks of each other, these three stack levels, that's called a brick wall. It's, it's very, very hard for price to get through those levels. So what we can do is, is we can sell the retracement on after news, 20 seconds after news, 15 to 20 seconds. This happened right at 20 seconds would be the lower high right there to get short around 60 to 63 fill, depending on your fill. 63 short right here at that level. So your short level is right here with market delta. So that was a short at 63 to 60, depending on your slippage right here. So you enter with market delta. Now I said um, a question happened in the room that if there would be another opportunity. Our, our, our member um, Khalid in the room, is there a bounce off 5309? Yes, that's my target, 5309 on this trade. But I said there'd be a, another wave down. So the wave up came, the second wave came here. And how we did it is, I said another wave possibly down is coming. And sure enough, it came back up. We got a negative 511 market delta. So your entry is the open of the next red bar. Your stop loss is always two ticks above that swing high. And so your fill on that one was 4546. And it got down to 20 low so far. So you have two shots at crude. You get a shot at 60 to 63 short into my HVA triple stack level. And then you had another shot at it with my negative market delta 511, anything over 200 and crude's big, at 45. So you have another shot right here. You have two waves. Those are your two big waves to get short after inventories. And this happens on a weekly basis with crude oil. The key is this. With crude, 
you want to try to sell the retracements if it's in a downtrend. If it's in an uptrend, if our trend filter is in an uptrend, you want to try to buy the retracement within a couple ticks of these three market profile levels. In other words, what we're trying to do is we're trying to see if these levels stack within a couple ticks of each other, and then we sell the retracement into those levels with negative or positive market building. So those are two wave, waves where you could have got short right after the news with your slippage would be there, and then here would be your fill there also. You had a wave short, trend down, sell high value area. Remember my price profile are the small dots, my volume profile, which is the most important, my big thick red line, and over here is developing profile that stopped at the exact tick. So that's called a three times stack level. You're not gonna get a better stack level on any market or any indicator better than volume profile, price profile developing when they come within a couple ticks of each other. That's called a brick wall, and you really, really want to take advantage of that either pre-news or post-news into the trade. Now, my overall target is going to be down here to the uh, my daily control point. I said 21 would be resistance to scale contracts or support, I'm sorry. But the overall trade, uh, overall level would be the control point. The reason I said 5309 would be a good level for this short, um, if it broke that level, would be that's a 62% retracement from yesterday low, so that should be a natural target where our crude oil inventories news release should hit. So we're getting close to it. Our sell up here at 60, we're down here at 20. That's $400 trade potential already. If you got short in the 45s, your low is 20, so you're still looking good on the position. Um, the overall target would be 5309 on the overall setup. All right, so news, the easiest way to play news, is you try to sell retracements or buy retracements with the overall trend direction into my market profile stack levels.